In today's video, I'm going to show you the best OBS settings for live streaming to Facebook, especially if you want to avoid any lags, any errors to make sure when you go live to Facebook, you actually have a smooth stream for your viewers. So let's not take much time. Let's get into it. What's going on guys? My name is Sammy watching our production tips and tools helping you master live streaming. So right now I have OBS, I have my camera and microphone already kind of ready to go live. And what I need to do really is just to go to the settings tab before we can go live to Facebook. And then what we need to do, we want to make sure we go to stream here. And what you need to do is to make sure you have your server URL and your stream key entered from Facebook. This is not part of the video, but it's important you have these two actually set right now next up you're gonna go to output this is very important now under output you want to make sure you actually change your output mode to advanced the first time you open obs may set up to simple so you want to make sure it's actually set to advanced now next thing you want to make sure you're under streaming tab and then you want to make sure you choose audio encoder just leave it to co audio acc video encoder make sure you actually choose nvidia nvec h264 this is the dedicated graphics card that i have on my pc if you don't have it you can actually choose x264 but i recommend you actually use your dedicated graphics card now next up you're gonna make sure you go to rescale output make sure it stays disabled and choose 1920 by 1080 so don't change this really now next up you want to make sure you go to encoder settings rate control keep it to constant b rate and then bit rate you want to make sure you set it to 6000 this is the maximum you can get on facebook and get the best quality when you're streaming in 1080 30 frames per second key in of what you want to make sure you set it to 2s and preset here you can actually play with it for me i leave it at p5 good quality and everything else you can copy my settings you don't have to overthink it one thing if your internet connection is not good to be able to accommodate the 6000 kbps you need to have an upload speed of at least 12 you know anywhere between 10 and 12 megabits per second or 12 thousand actually to know that you want to make sure you can go to google and type in internet speed test the first one is going to show up here you can just click on it and run your speed test and find out your upload speed your upload speed is the most important one now if you have anything below 10,000, you can actually lower the bit rate here as you can see i have plenty so i'm good but if you have anything lower than 10,000, you can actually try you know maybe four to five thousand you know anyway around four thousand should be able to give you really good image quality in 1080 okay but the max is six thousand so if you have good bandwidth go for it next up you want to make sure you go to the audio tab and then you can set your sample rate to 48 kilohertz and then the last part is gonna be under video go to base canvas resolution make sure it's set to 1920 by 1080 output rescale resolution 1920 by 1080 common fps value make sure it's actually set to 30 frames per second once you're done make sure you hit apply and hit ok and this should give you a smooth stream on facebook without having any errors now the next part is just to click the start streaming button and go live to facebook but if you have never done it before this is probably gonna be a little more complicated for you that's why i made another video showing you step by step how to go live using obs obviously to facebook i'm gonna link the video right here so check it out and i'll see you there guys take care